everyone, um, I am going to do a November Favourites video for you, um, just some of the things, products that I've really been enjoying using in November. Okay, um, first I have got the MAC 227 brush. I can't believe I live without this brush for so long. It's so soft and it really pick I feel like it really picks up a lot of colour. Um because I don't think it's as dense as some others, but it's also so huge. Yeah. Um that it just goes all the way up like look it goes practically the whole way. Um and I just can't get enough of this brush and this month I've actually been really really busy with uni so I have been quite lazy with my makeup so I've a, a lot of days I've just been using Ruben S paint pot and then like all the glitters or another just sort of shimmery browny colour eyeshadow on this brush and just straight away on done and um, another good thing about it is that it's thick that way but really thin that way so like I've also when I've been going home like home 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 from uni um, I've just been bringing this brush because you can also use on its side just in the crease if you're just doing something quite subtle which I like a lot <laughs> Sorry, coughing fit. Um, okay, second is my L'Oreal Studio Secrets Professional Smoothing Resurfacing Primer. And it looks like this. I peeled off the label. Um, but it's this pink sort of mousse consistency. And it's just amazing. It fills in any lines, it makes your skin so smooth. I just, it's like a sort of magic product, I feel like. Um, but there is a downside to it, which is that it's, I think it's like £13, £13.50, which is a lot for something that, from Boots. Um, and you also you don't use a little bit each time you need quite a lot to cover your entire face um i mean that i've probably used it four times so i think because it's a mousse it's got a lot of air in there so it doesn't really i don't know it's, it, I, I think that they could the packet the package could be a lot bigger for the price uh, but that's just a downside to it, it's, it's really amazing and I just use it on like more special occasions. Next I have my Chanel Rouge Coco lipstick in Lune Rousse which is number 36 um, and this was actually in I think it was October's Vogue or it might have been November's I think November's and it's this really pretty sort of dark red berry yeah it's more like that sort of colour but it's just gorgeous and I was looking for a colour like this and then I saw it in the Vogue and I went to an event at Harvey Nichols with my friend and I wanted to get this and it wasn't on display um, so I sort of looked for another one that was close because I wanted a sort of dark red and so I found one and I asked the woman to get it for me and it, they didn't have it but they had this one even though it wasn't on display so I was like yay it was meant to be last makeup product is my MAC mineralized skin finish which I know isn't a new product I've had it for a long time you can tell that like it's completely flat um, 
yeah, I I don't wear much found like, I don't wear foundation and um I wore this for quite a long time with a kabuki brush. Um like in the summer I didn't wear very much. I've just like concealer and stuff. Um and recently I've rediscovered this and I really love it. I feel like it just it makes my skin evened out. Um, but yeah, I really like this. I'm in the colour medium, which is almost worn out, which is shows how old it is. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, next, my penultimate item is a necklace from Urban Outfitters. And this I just love. I can't get enough of this. It's just a tiny little charm necklace and it's the perfect length and Urban Outfitters has loads of these and the range that this is in come in these tiny little envelopes so they're really cute to give as presents and they've each got a little sort of caption so this one's pretty as a picture and if you can see oh where is it okay you can't really see it but it's gorgeous um, and they've got all these different ones, they've got one that's a cuckoo clock and I think maybe like an anchor and loads, um, so, and it's only £10. Okay, and my final thing isn't a product at all, it's this sort of system, and if you've, um, you might have heard of the sort of fruit and vegetable box, organic fruit and vegetable boxes that get delivered each week and you have a different selection of vegetables in there every time and you pay a sort of weekly price um, well this is sort of a snack version <laughs> um, it's from a company called Graze graze.com I'm sorry I'm just covering my address and it's based on the premise that if you eat if you sort of graze throughout the day on food that has more sort of long lasting energy than one of those muffins that has millions of calories in then it's a lot healthier for you basically so it's all sort of dried fruit nuts crackers stuff like that so in here you get four punnets i've eaten one already and i have um a mix of goji berries cherries and organic apricots here a Focaccia with West Country Cheddar, Red Onion and Chutney here. Here I have cranberries, almonds and pecans. And the one that I've eaten is actually over here. <laughs> and this was honey, peanuts, cashews and pecans. So that would go in there. And you get it in your post in this little box and just through the letterbox. Um, as many times a week as you'd like and it's only £3 or £3.50 so I absolutely love that I look forward to it coming so much <laughs> it makes my Wednesdays wonderful <laughs> uh, so yeah they're my November favourites I hope you enjoyed them um, if you've got any suggestions questions anything uh, leave it in the comments below and I'll see you soon. Bye!